Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to another video today. Welcome back to another beautiful day here in California. Um, today, we got an update on the C8 Corvette order, but first, before we jump into that, I got an update on both the Boxster and the TC. We have more parts for this car coming. As of, I think it should be delivered later tomorrow. It should be t delivered tomorrow, if not the day after, but it's supposed to be delivered tomorrow, but the coronavirus, I think, has delayed some of the orders. So anyways, this a uh, new part coming for this car being delivered tomorrow hopefully as well as this car is getting repainted i think later next this month later next month we'll see the coronavirus is kind of screwing up the timing of everything um but in the meantime of that we actually have um interior uh, upgrades coming to this car um a little hint it is helps not with performance but safety is going to be awesome um it's a huge upgrade so be sure to stay tuned for that uh, but overall, that's pretty much the update on both these cars here. Um, I also, I realized um, that one thing we haven't had in a very long time is a cold start on these cars. So, actually, here in a minute, we're going to get a cold start on both of these cars. Um, but other than that, that's just the update on these two cars. So be sure to stay tuned for the install video of the new upgrade uh, part that we're getting again tomorrow if the day or the day after definitely one of those two days um, As well as be sure to check out the video on the the Porsche getting painted But that won't be till later as well as the install video of the Porsche Parts I, I don't want to say what it is, but you guys are gonna love it. Also. I'm sure you guys have noticed that my nails are blue um, And I'm sure you guys are wondering why um, for those who know me, my mother died of cancer two years ago, and throughout the five, I think it was like four or five years that she was diagnosed um, and fighting cancer, uh, it was colon cancer, by the way. But during those five years, to support and bring awareness to colon cancer, um, we always painted our nails blue. And this happens to be, March happens to be Colon Cancer Awareness Month. Um, so it's just to support my mom, who again died two years ago of colon cancer, as well as just anybody in general who has colon cancer. So for anyone who's fighting cancer or has issues or any kind of affiliation with cancer, stay strong, you guys will get through it. Take it from me, trust me. Um, but with that being said guys, let's hop into the Corvette update. Now we're here in my office where we're about to get, jump into the CA update, but I'm gonna try and start getting more cold stars for you guys. Um, Cause usually I have one, I just don't feature it for some reason because I'm stupid like that and I usually forget, but now we're actually starting doing more of those. Anyways, jumping into the CA Corvette update. Could you set you down right here? Um, so ultimately the update with the CA Corvette, um, the order's in. It's been accepted by GM. Um, I've been working with my guy in, um, not my local, but one of our other locals here in S Central Coast to do the whole like process, I guess you could say. Um, so our C orders in is now being transferred to the factory. Where once, so right now there's multiple levels which we're gonna cover. Um, we're still in the beginning stages, but it's gonna be really cool because we have a whole process ahead of us. And this process is gonna be absolutely amazing, you guys. Like. We're gonna get updates, and I'm sure with like other major YouTubers like Stratman, Street Speed 717, um, TJ Hunt, and anyone else who has ordered a uh, C8 Corvette has gone through this process already and now have gotten their cars. We're still on the um, latter end of that and we're still ordering the car. But good news is the order is officially in, is my point. So the order is in to GM, is now being transferred to the factory. Um, so kind of jump in, like I said, to explain to you about the different levels. I'm going to pull that up here in a second. Um, but first, um, the confirmation email isn't more or less an email. Um, I, I have confirmation information. It's on a private account on the website as well. 
uh, which I can pull up later. Um, but primarily right now, the main confirmation has been uh, verbal because um, everything's more or less done on their end. We don't worry about much on their end. It's just like, hey, we put on our financial stuff, we work with them, and then they say, okay, here's your order, your your car, you know, your information in, it's now being transferred to the factory, which then will start being built. So ultimately, now that our order's in, what's gonna happen is they'll process the order, kind of like any shipment, and then the build should begin between two to three months from now. Um, so two to three months from now, the build will begin. That could take anywhere between two to four or five months, it's kind of hard to say. I don't think it'll take that long. Once the car is done being built, it'll then sit on a lot for a few months. My guess is about three months, if that, um, give or take. So that means we'll be taking delivery of the car about nine months from now. It's kind of hard to you know, say, because you know, who knows what's gonna happen on their end. The coronavirus has been delaying the process. However, we did get our order in soon enough that the coronavirus and the whole shutdown um, hasn't affected us we will be getting to, the build will be getting on the car and won't be delayed due to it. Um, so our order's in. We are order level 1,100, 1, which will make sense in a second here. Actually, I'll pull it up right now. Um, so focus here. So here actually is the email where we actually have our confirmation. Um, we confirm your options with you. So he says, the next step will be when we reach out to place your order, which the order has been placed on their end. They have to then replace it on the um, the, the uh, factory side, uh, which is going on as we speak. So the whole process is a long process, but we're getting updated the next one. So the next update ultimately is when they get the order in which they'll say, okay, here's your order. Here's your build date, and then we'll get an actual build date. We'll get a VIN number, um, well, and that's the big thing. Once we get a VIN number, it should be within the next few weeks, I think, or a few months, maybe. It shouldn't take too long. So we'll get a build number, uh, I mean, a build date, a VIN number, and then the build will begin. Um, so right now, this email just states, you know, our orders in with them is just being transferred over to the manufacturer where they'll confirm the order and then give us all the information we need. That process takes a few weeks, um, especially because they have so many orders in. Um, but right now, um, we're status 1,100. And then we'll be moving to 2,000 and that's when we get all that information, you know, uh, the order. Anyway, so this, my point is this is the confirmation email here from the person we've been working at at the GM. Um, but to pull up the order levels, this is what is known as the event codes, which an event is different levels, different orders. So 500 means, so again, we're in the very beginning. Uh, we just put in this order the other day. Well, I last video, which was like a week, week and a half ago. Um, and it, everything takes a long time. So we put the first order in, which would have been 0500. And now that we're a thousand, which means that's what last video was out. We put our pre-order in and we had to get approved. Now that all the financials, everything's been approved, we're now at level 1,100, which is where it's we've placed the order at the dealership and has been accepted. Then we're actually we're actually we're actually not at 1,100. We're now at uh, 1102, um, which means there it's in the entire system, and now it's we're heading to 2000, which will be being accepted by the manufacturer at GM, which is nice, and that's when we get our VIN number and all everything else. Then we'll be moving along uh, here. The main one that we care about, the rest of this is all going down in the background, and ultimately we don't care about at all. Uh, the main one that we do care about here would be, let's see, which one was it? It's, um, Let's see here. So it's one of these where it says, okay, your build is now beginning. Um, this is just a lot of reading. I'm trying to save time here. Anyway, so the, it's the one of these will be, the build is just beginning. And I'll update you guys as we enter each one of these levels. Um, so, oh, it's 3,000. Um, yeah, so 3,100 is order available to sequence. That means it'll be going into build. 3,300 is when it actually is scheduled for production, and then thereforth, it begins the production line as it goes down, blah, blah, blah. Then order right down here is 4,200 is the next major one, is that's when the order is shipped to the dealership, and that's when I will fly out to um, whichever dealership they decide to deliver to. 
in which I will then pick up the vehicle or I may just have it delivered here, it's not 100%. I most likely will do like what Stradman did and a much bunch of other people did like TJ Hunt. Where I'm gonna go pick up the vehicle at the place and then drive it all the way home. Um, especially because the closest one isn't too far. Um, it's like eh, a 12, 14 hour drive, uh, which I'd split up into two days and enjoy the car. Um, and that wouldn't happen up until level 6,000, which is vehicle delivered to customer. So the main ones that we care about, my remind you, we're now at 11, well, level 1102. The next one we'll be caring about is 2,000. Once, and that's the one we'll get confirmation at. Then we'll be caring about the next three, which would be 3,300 3, and 3,300. 3300 is the main one because that's when the car will actually be, be built and that'll be and we won't get this confirmation code for about another three months give or take then all this blah blah, blah this will be happening in background we won't care about this up until we hit order 4200 actually one of these yeah so 3800 is the vehicle has been produced so 3800 is the other one this one's just the vehicle's been built. Here's your VIN number. Um, and then it moves to 4200. That's the main one we care about. That's like, okay, the vehicle, the car is built. We're now shipping. So once we're done here at 4200 and the order is shipped, we will then continue to 600 once it's delivered to, I mean, 6,000 once it's delivered to the dealership. Um, so once the vehicle has been delivered to the dealership, like I said, I focus, please. I will fly out um, to the dealership and either pick up the car or we'll have it delivered here. It's not 100% yet. That's still six months away. Um, ultimately though, we will be picking that car up, I think to save money. Plus it'll be nice to drive the car and get a look at it in person. And plus, you know, that's content. You're gonna vlog on the entire thing. Um, but so ultimately we're still in the beginning process, um, which I know, uh, this kind of sucks, but it's a long process. Should take between anywhere between six and nine months. Just depends on how everything goes. If everything goes well, hopefully we'll be taking delivery of the car within like six, seven months. Realistically, we'll be taking delivery of the car about nine months to 12 months. All depends. Uh, but the order is 100% official and confirmed and in. So that means now it's just the wait process and getting updates of the car's process and the entire time I'll be updating you guys on everything that's happening and when we get the order and all that. Um, so I hope you guys kind of enjoyed today uh, and kind of the update. It's 100% it's official now. Our order is in and we're going to be getting it processed soon and the build will begin in just a matter of weeks to months now. Like for example, I actually ended up my, my uncle also ordered one. He placed his pre-order about three months before we did. He is now at level um, 3300. So he is scheduled for production and will be beginning built, I think a week and a half from now. Then his, so he'll be taking delivery of his car like four months from now, it's unbelievable. He's actually gone to the dealer, his local dealership and taken a look and driven one of the ones they had in his spec. Um, obviously you can't get that one because that um, is a dealership car and the new one's going and his is already on order and all that. So he's already got his. His is, he's at level 3300 and it took about two and a half months to get there. We're um, almost there, we're almost at level 2000 and then from there pretty much it's just going to take off. Um, but we're, the order, official order is in guys so the C8 order is official. We're now just waiting on their their system and them to process the vehicle and do the entire thing. But with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Be sure to like and subscribe because we have a bunch of updates coming, a bunch of cool installations, as you guys saw earlier on the TC and the Porsche. Um, we have a bunch of updates, I and mean, this is gonna be so cool to tag, you know, for you guys to tag along and kind of watch this whole thing happen. You know, again, the C8. Um, and not only once we get the C8. You guys are sure we're gonna be vlogging a bunch on that car. We'll be doing stuff to that car. I mean, it is gonna be absolutely, I mean, it's such an amazing car. So be sure to guys subscribe and stay tuned to the channel um, to see further updates and content on the car. But with that being said, guys, I hope you liked today's video. Be sure to like and subscribe. Every like uh, helps. I appreciate every one of you who does so, but be sure to please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day.